In this video we're going to talk about crypto. So basically I'm going to describe how to get USDC into GBP but avoid the fees on Coinbase specifically. So essentially the plan here is that we're going to, if you are trading in to USDC and you're trying to get it into GBP but you don't want to pay those fees for you know transferring between uh, the US dollar and uh, the Great British Pound. That's essentially what we're going to go through on this. And it's a really easy tactic. You do need PayPal for this. Um, and if you are trading on Coinbase Advanced, then you're going to need to switch to Coinbase Usual, which is a really easy switch. I'll go through step by step now uh, how to do this. You will need to link your PayPal account to your Coinbase. Uh, and you will need to be a verified user on Coinbase to withdraw uh, certain amounts to uh, PayPal itself. So I'll just go through step by step and hopefully this will make sense to everyone. Um, but yeah, it took me a while to figure this out because it's not obvious <laughs> that it's possible to do this without paying fees. So in my example, basically, I was trading uh, GRT into US dollar because you couldn't trade GRT into GBP. For some unknown reason but it is what it is on coinbase so essentially step one log into coinbase make sure you're a verified user click the top right button so where there's a little profile icon in the top right corner uh, and then click preferences click account limits and then that'll tell you whether you're verified or not if you're not verified make sure you're verified and then move on to step two so step two is make sure you have a PayPal account, just the standard UK one uh, will do. As you're trying to withdraw in GBP, I assume you'll be in the UK and wanting to get it in Great British, British Pounds. Um, so yeah, create your PayPal account, hook up your um, debit card or your bank account to the PayPal uh, so you can withdraw into it from there. Step three, in the preferences page, so in the top right page again, click payment methods, and then click add a payment method and then it'll give you the option to click PayPal so if you click PayPal it'll take you to the PayPal website PayPal like you, you go through all the verification and stuff and then eventually you'll link it basically just sync in the account with your account on Coinbase and uh, you can only withdraw to PayPal you can't pay through PayPal uh, to buy crypto with this particular method uh, step five, so we'll go to Coinbase Advance now, and then we'll do our trading. So, you know, if you're trading whatever coin it is, in this example, it was GRT to USDC. So you make whatever trades you're making, and then hopefully you'll, you know, make a good trade and you'll make some money. Fingers crossed. Um, and then basically you'll end up with USDC in your account. So you've paid with GBP, you've traded to get GRT, you've made some money by selling GRT into USDC, and now you're stuck with USDC. So there are some options. If you want to use the standard Coinbase option, uh, you can trade it you know, for other cryptocurrencies and then trade it to GBP if you wanted to. Or alternatively, if you just want to get that USDC out, uh, into GBP without paying any fees. This is the main part of the video. So basically you need to click in the top right uh, corner again and it'll give you the option to go back to Coinbase Simple I think it is or Coinbase Normal. It's the white version of Coinbase and then there's you know Advanced is the black version of Coinbase so you got the option between the two. So click the Simple version, go into that and then you're going to want to click into the uh, my assets tab go into my assets click USDC and that should show you how much USDC you've got available and then if you've got your settings set to like GBP it'll tell you how much you've got available as British pounds pretty much so then next you would go and choose the amount of in, well you click sell and then you choose the amount that you want to sell there's a little box in the sort of right hand side of the page once you've clicked that, you've got your amount. There's a little box below 
the USDC box, which will say either like GBP or US dollar or something like that. Click that box, change that to PayPal. And then that'll basically say that you're transferring USDC to PayPal for the amount of however many pounds. So once you've done that, you click preview sell. So you choose your amount. Let's say you're withdrawing 100 pounds worth of USDC. Um, and that'll come up and it'll say specifically the zero fees. You're trading it at, you know, whatever the rate currently is, which was like 0.78-ish um, at the time I was doing it. So there's no fees at all. You click preview sell, it'll tell you all the information. Click sell. That should go straight into your PayPal account. You might have to log into your PayPal account or whatever for two-factor authentication. Um... So you, you've basically got your USDC into GBP without paying any fees in that point. Once it's in PayPal, you log into PayPal, you click withdraw to your debit card or your bank, and that's also free, or at least it is for me. So that is essentially how you withdraw for free rather than trading USDC to GBP in some other fashion because you will pay huge fees on that and it ain't worth it so hopefully this video helps i know there's a lot to take in i'll write it in sort of a step by step um on the screen so that you, you see what's there but yeah hopefully you enjoyed the video if this did help please do like and subscribe and comment always appreciated um but yeah it's just sort of a one-off video because it, I was struggling to get it out without paying the fees. And uh, I found this method myself. So feel free to use it. Hopefully it uh, stays that way. <laughs> Fingers crossed. But yeah, best of luck with trading. I don't endorse any crypto trading as well. I'm not like advocating for it. I'm just saying if you do this, this is the way to cash out. USDC to GBP without paying fees. But yeah, if, if anyone's got any advice or anything in the comments as well, always appreciated. Um, but yeah, thanks for watching. Take care. Peace out.